Hi, this is Artifacts of Mars, and this is the premiere episode of the Porky Pig Awards. Uh, it was inspired by uh, Nancy Pelosi and Paul Ryan getting together and sponsoring a just monster $1.1 trillion spending bill. I guess it funds everything. And... Ryan won 150 GOP votes from 150, obviously, liberal uh, congressmen. They pretty much all agreed with this. It was uh, 316 to 113 vote. So, only 18 Democrats voted against the bill while 166 supported it. So, that is expected to pass the package later in the day after pairing it with a massive tax package uh, approved by the House on Thursday. So they're going to tax the living tar out of you. This is Democrats and Republicans, so they're both guilty. Uh, Republicans weren't able to secure tighter restrictions on Syrian refugees entering country, a language block funds for Planned Parenthood amendments offered by conservatives in the House Rules Committee hearing this week were rejected. So, what's happened here is, er, Obama and Democrats are getting everything they want. You're going to have more illegals flooding in. You're going to have more Syrians coming in and probably carrying out uh, be a bunch of terrorist attacks. But check this out. I know a Republican. I'm not in the Republican Party. Check this out. Paul Ryan, who's the new Speaker of the House, uh, promotes open borders, but look what he has around his uh, big, huge mansion. Offense. That's right. He's uh, fencing out the illegals. He's going to wall his place off. But you and I, screw you. We uh, just basically get boned. So while they're letting in more of these uh, illegals and issuing visas on a, uh, to let take away more and more American jobs you know, bringing in these migrants. This jerk is building a fence around his property. See, they want to protect themselves, but they don't care about you and I. They're for themselves. They are for, you know, total immigration so they can get all the cheap labor they want. They want to be basically a bunch of serfs. One of the few ones that are on our side is uh, Senator Jeff Sessions. And of course, uh, Donald Trump and Ted Cruz. This is why Donald Trump is so popular, is because of crap like this. I got one more, uh, one or two more articles to look at. Hang on. The same jackal is funding sanctuary cities. You see, sanctuary cities are where they've taken in illegal aliens and they're sheltering them. And they should lose all federal funds and uh, the mayors of these cities and city councils and so forth that are doing this, as far as I'm concerned, should be arrested. and should be sent to the Iron Bar Motel. So what happens? We have this jackal. This despicable jackal, Representative Paul Ryan, R.W.I., Wisconsin, I guess, uh, is bringing in more and more illegal.
illegals. You won't listen to anything that we have to say. And he basically agrees with uh, Nancy Pelosi and Obama. This is not, this is what we mean by rhinos. You know, this is what I uh, got put in there after John Bonehead resigned. John Bonehead started this stuff. I mean, Boehner. Did I say call him Bonehead? You, you people are, you're so screwed. Because of the greed of SOBs like this. <laughs> We're all so screwed. And here's the rush man uh, talking about this. I guess from what this article says, uh, he'd like to disband the Republican Party. I mean, why not? Why not just turn them all in Democrats? They pretty much are anyway. There's simply no stopping Democrats. There's no mechanism. Every constituted me mechanism found in the power of her separation of powers, the Republican Party years ago gave it away in total fear of the media. That's about the size of it. Another factor also needs to be mentioned, too, in that many Republican donors want every bit of mo this money spent, and they have donated voluminously to key Republicans in order to keep them, get the money spent. So it's all not all Republican fears. It's not all Republican caving. A lot of it is Republican fealty and loyalty to some of their donors. Some people today are looking at this, and this is 20, 2009 pages. It's said to be a spending bill. Among that, the things that it does, it fully funds Obamacare. And Rush goes on and on. And he just rips them unbelievable. Well, like I said, it's so, just says, Sessions says this is a betrayal, fully funding Obama immigration agenda, the climate change agenda, increasing foreign workers. It is a betrayal. These people... You know, we don't have anybody who stands up for us. They're all for themselves. I don't care whether you're talking Democrat or Republican. They're all for themselves. So, you know, thank God for Rush. Uh... I'll just read the end of this. Sanctuary cities fully funded. All Mideast immigration programs fully funded. All these things that have been exploited by terrorists. Sanctuary cities fully funded. All refugees fully funded. The release of criminal aliens fully funded. Everything. Democrat leftist wet dream has just been paid for. He's right. Like I said, thank God for Rush. He's not a perfect person, but in these times, I'm sure glad he's here. I don't know what to tell you. We're screwed. We are so screwed. I'm out of facts on Mars. <laughs>